employees at Miller Electric Company are eagerly awaiting the arrival of Vice President Pence and Ivanka Trump. The two are expected to arrive later on this afternoon. Action News Jack's Lorena Inclan continues our team coverage live at the company right now. Lorena expected to speak uh, to employees there in a little while. They are. They'll be here around 1.45 to deliver those remarks. And uh, there's a reason why the vice president and the president's daughter, Ivanka Trump, chose Miller Electric. This company is headquartered here in Jacksonville. And the company says that it's been able to add 300 more jobs ever since the tax cuts were enacted back in 2018 as part of President Trump's uh, tax reform plan. And so that's one of the major reasons, uh, you know, they're coming here to talk about that. And you can expect to hear that in uh, the vice president's remarks later on today. I do want to give you a look at what's going on behind me because right now Miller Electric workers are here in the area where Vice President Pence will soon give his remarks. They're having lunch right now and it's not just workers from Miller Electric who are here but also union employees from the International Brotherhood of Electrical Workers are also here to, to listen to the Vice President as well as Ivanka Trump give those remarks. I do want to show you video from earlier today when Vice President Mike Pence and Ivanka Trump are Arrived here in Jacksonville at NAS Jacksonville in Air Force Two. Uh, you can see them there uh, on the tarmac and shaking hands. Uh, they'll first make their way over to Operation New Hope, where Elizabeth is, and then they'll come over here to speak with the employees and not only speak with them, but they're also going to be getting a tour of this facility. We've learned that they're going to be visiting a couple of areas around this massive warehouse like facility and speaking with employees, seeing what they do. One big thing that this company does is focus on technology in the media kit that the marketing director gave reporters earlier today. It says that Miller Electric is not afraid of losing their jobs to robots because they view technology as an assistant and not a replacement. I expect to be hearing some of that in the remarks here today. I'll keep my ear out for that. And also, as soon as he takes the podium here behind me, we will be sure to let you know. We're also going to be live streaming some of the events here on our website, actionnewsjacks.com. And coming up next at five, the reason you will be seeing more people from the Trump administration visit visit Florida and not just Florida but specifically here Jacksonville we'll have that for you next at five reporting live on the south side Lorena Inclan CBS 47 action news Jacks